Okay, let's design with light. Okay, let's uh, set up this uh, for staged studio photography. With this setup, I can actually put heavier uh, props or objects. Be careful. To equip the students with um, critical thinking, teach them broad skills, and make them curious about everything by means of demonstration. With the students, I insist that they're using plexiglass just for safety. <laughs> One layer, two, three layers. Very similar to what we now experience in uh, the uh, digital technology with, say, let's Photoshop. We also work with layers, very similar. So now I'm going to use uh, letter forms. As a graphic designer, I can't resist. Um, here, a 3D letter form. Um, this happened to be made out of wood. Um, and we want to set up these letter forms as dynamic as possible. So the end I'm going to cut out of the backdrop. An assignment such as white is a perfect balance to something more pragmatic like logotype design. And uh, I call it uh, the yin and yang of design education. Another important thing I, I didn't mention yet, that every plane and every component needs to be made from white material, okay? That's very important. Um, because the magic is here that I am able to change these, uh, the white color to a whole range of gray all the way to the impression of black. Uh, and then in addition I could project, of course, instead of white light I could project color light. That's another possibility. In my younger days, uh, it was easier to detect uh, the uh, place of origin uh, of a designer's uh, work. Um, but today, I think since everybody uses um, the same uh, equipment like Apple and uh, Adobe software, it all became uh, more generic looking. And uh, I think this is a, a future uh, challenge for designers to have their own identity. And also, um, when I asked incoming sophomore students if they know Paul Rand, they're not familiar with him, but they know a, 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 this filmmaker like Tim Burton. So it's quite interesting you know, where the uh, importance lies. Okay, a little softer. becomes a little bit more um, dramatic, okay? And of course, the point is that with my uh, recording equipment here, the still camera or the video camera, I'm trying to crop the image, crop the arrangement. So in other words, I don't want to reveal the outside of the sheet of glass or the blocks, the cinder blocks, etc. Okay. Well, there's an old saying what goes around comes around, or one extreme attracts the other extreme. 
Okay. Now, the other thing is we could also use a backlight, meaning behind the backdrop, which could be interesting. Okay. So, that in addition. Light is a basic design element in graphic design. 